I've just had my flu jab and uh, I've, I've only just come back and saw on the internet that uh, apparently um, it was suggested that by a German broadcaster that uh, that Mercedes would swap um, Valtteri Bottas and George Russell around for the final uh, two Grand Prix in uh, Saudi Arabia and Abu Dhabi but uh, apparently um, Total Wolf rejected it. Well, I've got to admit that uh, I was thinking the same along the same lines um, at least until and until the point that uh, um, Valtteri Bottas found um, tremendous form and um, after signing his three three year deal with uh, with Alfa Romeo um, you know before then before he did that I would have swapped them now no, no, no doubt about it, but uh, I think uh, it was the right decision that Total Wolf rejected it because, you know, um, I, th I think uh, everybody would agree that Vitry Boss has, um, has been the, in the, in the, in, has been in the form of his career to be honest I, I don't know what it is with certain drivers and um, you know as uh, you know because uh, one one would uh, one would think that uh, he 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 would they would sort of um, put drive their heart out so that they're not gonna get um, replaced you know what I mean and now, now that now that I, but as knows what he's doing, and um, he 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 drives in the, in the form of his career, in my opinion. So I uh, I think um, had he had he driven like this um, before uh, it was announced that uh, he would leave. Uh, Mercedes, i.e., had he driven like this earlier in the season, I think he, um, he would have, um, he he might have kept the seat. Having said that, I wonder whether, um, I wonder whether Mercedes was under a bit of pressure to uh, to um, promote. George Russell and um, to the Mercedes team, uh, you know, in terms of contracts or so. And, I mean, I'm not suggesting that there was there was anything of the kind, but I can I can uh, I can um, imagine that the, that could have been a possibility. Um, and uh, I have I've also read that uh, Lewis Hamilton. Apparently, once, um, once um, George Russell to be um, the next British world world champion after he re re retires, um, I think um, George Russell is in a, in a very good position to learn from the best. Um, I would love Lewis Hamilton to get the eighth world title um, because I think he deserves it. Yes, it would mean that uh, it, it, it would mean that uh, you know he, he 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 would overtake my idol, but uh, Michael Schumacher. But uh, I think uh, Lewis Hamilton is just driving incredibly well and. Uh, 
what he's done for the sport um, is 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 also incredible. And like I keep saying, I think uh, we need to enjoy having Lewis, Lewis Hamilton around uh, because we're not going to have him around for long. I think uh, he's already stated in a in a in an interview interview um, that after. Um, 2023, um, he will definitely step away from Formula One. So I, I reckon um, uh, George, George Russell can absolutely learn from the master himself um, and then take over his his uh, his his, his um, position as team leader at Mercedes when the time comes that Lewis Hamilton is going to step away from Formula 1. Anyway guys, this is just what I'm thinking. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Cheers for watching. Um, you know, I really appreciate you watching. Um, it, it really makes my day. Um, and uh, if you if you haven't already, please do consider to like this video, leave me a comment so that we can start a discussion about it and uh, also share it with your friends. So um, share this video with your friends so that we can grow this channel together. Um, and finally, uh, also click the subscribe button and uh, activate the bell so that you never miss out on uh, when I upload another video. Um, I'll speak to you later guys. Bye for now. Bye.